and welcome back to my channel. For a while now people have been asking me to do an eyeliner tutorial so that's what we're going to do today. One of the important things to remember whilst watching this video is that I can only show you what works for me. Now everybody's eyes are different, <laughs> clearly. You know a lot of people watch these videos and they sort of they try the tips and tricks of these people are showing them and it doesn't necessarily work for them and then they kind of take it out on the person doing the tutorial saying oh you know you told me that this would work and it didn't well sadly everybody's eyes are different you have different eye shapes different skin types that sort of thing and you know what works for me isn't guaranteed to work for you the skin around your eyes is delicate whether lifestyle um stress you know that sort of thing can all have an effect on how your skin ages um genetics also play quite a large part in that um you know and, and eye shapes do determine what will and won't work for you makeup wise but having said that i am going to still try and show you how i do my eyeliner and hopefully whatever i do can help you out too for today's tutorial I'll be using Kat Von D's Tattoo Liner in Trooper. I figured starting off with a liquid liner would probably be the best place to start, but I hope to do a few more tutorials in the future using, you know, creams and gels and, and probably liquid lipsticks too because I do use them for eyeliner occasionally. So to start off I always prime my eyelids and even if I'm not doing something kind of crazy eyeshadow wise I always use a nude eyeshadow and apply that to the lid as well because my eyes are hooded they um, sometimes sweat um, which is gross and disgusting and horrible um, but, but sometimes they sweat and I want my liner to stay on my lid and not work its way all the way up to here into the crease and kind of smear and look a little bit ridiculous so I always prime and use a nude eyeshadow first which I've already pre-done I found Kat Von D's tattoo liner to be the best liquid liner in pen form on the market for me personally um, the new brush tip makes it so much easier to get those really defined sharp lines uh, lots of people ask me how I get them so sharp and straight and I really would not be able to do it without any of the products that I use and this is my number one go-to for a liquid pen so when applying my liner I like to start sort of at the outer edge then go to the inner corner and then sweep and kind of fill in the the wing what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom in and I'm going to slow it right down for you so hopefully you can see what I'm doing and hopefully seeing it it's a lot easier to understand than me talking about it so uh, we're going to do that zoom in slow it right down and hopefully that will be helpful okay so we've zoomed right in and I do apologize for the terrible brows I've got going on right now I will get them fixed at some point but meh, on the scale of life things they're not a priority right now um so I'm going to slow this down I'm going to apply it slow it right down and hopefully you'll get a better idea of how I do my liner
Now, if your wing isn't as sharp as you'd like it to be, or you've made any error in doing it, that's what makeup wipes are for. So I just like to put it around my finger, pull it up like this, and then I go to the inner corner of my wing, and then just work across the line, bringing it up towards my eyebrow. And you can just do that until you're happy with how sharp it looks and how clean it looks. If you've already done your foundation, etc., and you kind of want to fix it up, then all you have to do is get a little bit of concealer and a angled brush and kind of go along. But I can show you that in another video. Okay, so hopefully watching it in slow-mo has helped you kind of get a better idea of how I do it. The things to remember is not to press down too hard. Very fine, light strokes will help you get the lines that you want. And don't worry if, you know, it's not going exactly how you want it to. Makeup is meant to be fun. You can just wipe it off and start again if you want to. Or if you don't want to, go grab yourself a slice of cake, eat your feelings, and then come back and do it again. That's what I do. So... Hopefully by zooming in, that's kind of helped a lot of people try and see what, what I do. Um, try and keep the lines small and close to your lash line if you've got hooded eyes like me, because otherwise when you get too warm, or if you're going out dancing or whatever, it inevitably will end up trying to work its way up and into the actual crease of your hood, and then you end up with kind of blurry mush here. Um, and... The thing to do is practice, practice, practice. That's all the advice I can give, to be honest. Um, the next tutorial I'll do on eyeliner, I will probably use either a cream or a gel liner to try and show you how to do it with that. Hopefully this video has helped you, and if it did, and if you liked it, please leave me a thumbs up. Say hello in the comments section. I love hearing from people. Uh, if you want to see more from me and my weird face, then uh, hit that subscribe button. Hopefully I'll be able to do some more eyeliner tutorials, not just the basics, maybe a few kind of out there fun things as well in the future. If you'd like to see that, let me know. Don't forget you can stalk me on Instagram if you want. It's at Layla Masquerade and I do put a lot of my eye looks and lip looks up there. So hopefully I'll get to see you very soon. Until next time, have a fantastic week. Bye!